and welcome back to it. Oh! Mama, here's my snowflake. <laughs> okay. <gasps> Anyways. Okay. Mm. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm in quarantine. Let's right, get to the point. I thought, what are people going to look up in this time of need? And it hit me because I was going to look it up. How do you make your own toilet paper? You know, like, how do they do it, huh? Could I save money and just make my own? So, let's find out. Nice. Everyone knows the first one is always the best one. <laughs> That's a lie, don't, don't, don't listen to me, kids. But here we go! <laughs> So this page starts off with like alternatives to toilet paper and it's like facial tissues, Kleenex, paper towels, baby wipes, which are, yeah, you know, those are nice. And like things found around the house, newspaper, a sponge, water, and I'm like, okay, cloth, okay, and then it goes to found outdoors, <laughs> it goes Leaves, maple, large leaved aster, cottonwood, hazelnut, thimbleberry, fuzzy lamb's ear is one of the options. They're like, if you're out in the wilderness and you really need to clean up up down there, try finding a little fuzzy lamb and use their ear. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's a plant or something. Sue me if I'm wrong. But if any normal person were to look at this and see... Fuzzy lamb's ear. It's a good suggestion. It's a good suggestion. Okay. Any paper. Except for glossy news the magazine. This is newspaper, so oh, we're good. A pot. Water. Now Jean. Aloe baby oil. Or any type of unscented lotion. Shit. Mm. Okay, after looking through my freaking house, the only thing I could find was nothing. Except for baby shampoo. But it will have to do because we are surviving. And we are thriving. Quarantined and alone. Okay, next step. Grass and leaves. I can do that. Gosh, it's sprinkling. Okay, okay. Grass and leaves, grass and leaves. Grass and leaves. Check. Rolling pin. We have one of those. Mallet or hammer. This just, my gosh, toilet paper is intense. Sheets or towel. Ladle, ladle. Ladle or spoon, large cutting board or other flat board. All right. Shh, good gosh. He's hungry. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. Something I didn't mention that I thought was necessary was goggles. And I found these in my dad's room. But one side's missing. Don't worry though, we're protected, kind of. Okay, let's see. Okay, step one, soak the paper in water first to remove as much ink as you can, especially if you are using newspaper. Once at least three-fourths of the ink has seeped out of the paper, you can pull it from the soak water. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah. All right. Paper. You're about to be toilet paper. It doesn't specify. I don't know if it can be folded or not. Toilet paper. Nice and soaked. Do, do, do. Get off there, ink. Scrub it up. Scrub, rub, dub, rub it up. Do, do. <laughs> and 
I need a towel. Oh, it told me to have a towel. But what if it's supposed to be dry? Napkins. No, those could be used as toilet paper. <laughs> ah! This is taking a long time. Nothing's happened. How long does it take to de-ink paper? Scrub, scrub, scrub. Oh, I ripped it. Don't do that. Don't do that. Okay, so I just read the next step. I should have done this first. And it says, After you soak the paper, place it in the pot with two handfuls of grass and leaves. So apparently the water wasn't supposed to go in the pot. It was just the water was the... They should have specified. Ugh. Just dumped out my water. I have this soaking piece of newspaper. Now I have to dry out my pan with more newspaper. I can't use toilet paper or paper towels. Uh, I could just use like a beach towel. Uh, oh well, we're already this far. It's not working very well. Ten out of ten, don't recommend. Oh my god, I just had an idea. You know how the first step is to get, like, the ink off the paper? What if I just use, like, printer paper? That'd be smart. I'm gonna do that. So I finally read further into the instructions. And it says, After you soak the paper, place it in a pot with two handfuls of grass and leaves and cover with water. So, I put this in a pot. And then put grass and leaves on it. And then cover with water and then after you soak the paper place it in a pot with two handfuls of the bring it to a boil and allow it to simmer for one hour <sighs> this is gonna take so much work oh my gosh so we have the paper in the pot yes yes Sean say two handfuls of grass and leaves my bien. Okay, now we don't want to start the fire, so we get that all tucked in there nice and good. Yes, yes. Didn't want to waste the water before, so I put it in this giant bowl that is now putting back into the paper and the leaves and the grass. Ah. Nice. I think we need more water. I don't know, so I'm going to add some more. More water, yes. Haha. <laughs> God, I hope I don't start a fire. It hasn't even started simmering yet. <gasps> oh, I was gonna go see if we had any snacks. Oh, I got some snacks! Hasn't been simmering for 30 minutes, and my house smells like grass. I kind of like it, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, guys, so it's been boiling. And I think it's so cool, look, look, look. Underneath, it's like orange. Like, did I make a tea, bro? Am I making like tea and toilet paper? Guys, this might be revolutionary. Well, I don't think I'd drink it, but maybe, maybe. Okay, I'm super impatient. It has been like 45 minutes, close enough to an hour, you know. I don't think this will work anyways. It's fine. So, now the instructions say to... They're all like, be careful. The paper is now pulp. Blah, blah, blah. You have to remove the water and then add the lotion. Shit. I probably shouldn't add baby shampoo. It'll just get soapy. And you don't want to like soap down there you want to just lotion it ha they say baby oil could i add vegetable oil or olive oil olive oil let's try olive oil yeah yeah we'll do that okay 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 ah! that was stressful now we have our little bowl hmm do you think so it's I'm gonna dump this water all over the place. It's gonna be so bad. Okay. What if I just... I don't feel... I feel like I don't need all this grass. Do I need all this grass? Is the grass part of the pulp? 
Or do I just need the paper in the grass? Uh, I don't know. I don't want to wipe my butt with grass. We're not going to put it in the grass. Ouch. Okay, that one was a lot. Ew, it is poopy. Ugh. Oh, that's slimy. <sighs> Okay, so this might be a little grassy. <gasps> oh, I see a big old chunky boy. <laughs> I just ripped it. That's fine. It's fine. I love chunky spotty toilet paper. It's fine. Get out of here, grass. This literally smells just like tea. And I don't drink tea, but this smells good. Like, I feel like I'm, like, if I had the coronavirus... Smelling this tea is curing me right now. Is there any more in here? Am I just... Ooh! Oh, that broke off. Okay. Come on, give me the paper. Oh, shit. Dude, get... I don't know why I keep using the tongs. Look at how much easier that is if I just use my fingers. Okay, is that, oh my god, is that another chunk? How much paper is in here? This is, this is fascinating, honestly. Get, ah! Okay, that was dramatic, I'm sorry, it doesn't actually that bad. Get off! Look at the things I do for toilet paper. <laughs> If this works, I'm going to be so impressed. Okay. Okay. Oh my god! Some toilet paper! Come here, come here, come here. Score. Okay, so now... We have this lovely boy. That's mush! Yay! I can't really remember. We're going off memory now, but that's fine. The next step says, lay the pulp on a flat towel that we're going to just, nice, get out this, oh wow, look, this towel's like exfoliating, how nice, okay, now we have the pulp, nice and mache, god, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, and then it says, Roll it out. <laughs> this isn't <working>. <laughs> <laughs> uh, No, that didn't do anything. I'm not even going to pretend that did anything. Oh my god. How do you... Then it's, <laughs> it says if there's chunks, hammer them out. <laughs> I'm like... That might have to happen because this is so chunky. Oh my god. Maybe I just wasn't rolling hard enough. Maybe I gave up too quickly. But nothing, nothing was happening. Mm -hmm. I'll flatten it out. Give myself a head start. This is just wet paper. What the heck? Okay. Jesus. Oh, no. Oh, my God. I forgot. You're supposed to mix it with the... Oh, I'm so stupid. With the oil. Okay. Okay. God damn it. This is why you fall on short times, kids. Do do. Your toilet paper depends on it. Okay, put that back in there. And we're going to use olive oil because why not? Whoa, wait, what is it? Oh, wow. This has never been opened. Sorry, mom and dad. If you were saving this for something important. That looks good. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, it's done. Do do. Okay. Uh. Mix it on. Mix it up. Mm -hmm. This is <laughs> doing it. I think it's supposed to be like a mush, and it's not. I don't know. I don't know why. Uh, I probably because really I took it out early, but that's fine. We are in a time crunch for pooping and surviving here. These shits won't take care of themselves. These shits. Do you think that's what parents say? These shits won't take care of themselves. <laughs> That's what I'd say as a parent. All right. You know what? That's going to have to be good. Now it's oily. Oh, it smells good. I feel like I could eat it. It's like tea mixed with cooking oil. 
my god this is, this is not going good can you see look at this <laughs> okay i'm gonna try i'm gonna try hammering it what if i break this table hey hey that's working hammer 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 <laughs> it's flashed on me hammer hammer so close, oh, I think I see. Grass, grass, grass. Get out of your mind. Get out of your mind. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna try and use this ruler, roller, roller, roller. <laughs> use a <this> ruler. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. What the fuck? You don't understand. Ah, it's not working. Okay, well, you know what? We're just gonna have some thick toilet paper. You know, get Northern Ultra Soft or Plush or whatever it is they use. And then it says to put it in the sun until it dries. And I'm like, no, 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 no. First, you have to put it under something heavy, heavy and flat. Like, you put something flat on it, and then you just put heavy things on that. Oh my god, heavy things. On the two biggest books I could find. And now we're going to let it get smushed. I kind of forgot about it. And then I got, oh my god. And then I got busy. I know. This better not be disappointing. Okay. Drum roll, please. Oh, oh it's gone. Oh, it's <laughs> it was stuck to the board. Okay, so now that it's flat, it's not flat, it's still chunky. <laughs> it smells like grass. It says, oh no, it's not going to come off in one piece. It says I'm supposed to. Put it in the sun. But now it's evening. We don't have a sun. What if we put it in the oven and put on the broiler? That's like the sun. So I got a cooking pan. And I turned on. I got some wax paper. I turned on the broiler in the oven so it'd start heating up. How do I get this off this? Ooh, ooh. Oh my gosh, it's working. Do you see what I'm doing? I'm like... Go, go, go. Oh, no, it broke. It's fine. God, this might be the most disgusting piece of toilet paper I have ever seen. Also the most disgusting one I've ever made. Okay, I put that on there. Now let's do this thing. So the broiler is on. That looks like the sun, right? All right, so we're gonna put that in there and hope we don't start a fire. Wow, look at toilet paper is being made. I have no idea how long this is gonna take. Oh, it's steaming. That's kind of cool. Well, I just gotta make sure it doesn't start on fire. <laughs> So, the wax paper started smoking, and I just don't know how to go about this anymore. We don't have a sun. Oh my goodness. Maybe if I breathe on it really hard. But no, that wouldn't work. Oh, I was so excited. 